Okay, it's a few hours later, and I'm going to show you what we got. The silicone's dry. You can see I got a speaker up there, and it's flat. That's incredibly important. You don't want nothing poking you in your head. And you notice I didn't do anything else to the helmet, so it's still going to be, you know, DOT approved. I haven't done anything to, to hurt it in any way. What I'm going to do now is... Um, gonna hot glue just one of these wires down just so it stays out the way and then I'll clean up the other wire with some duct tape or electrical tape and I'll put it all back together and uh, show you what it sounds like all right just gonna see do a sound test real quick Sounds pretty good. Okay, it's all the way back together. And now if you look in there, can't tell anything. It all looks normal. It's gonna feel normal. It's gonna sound really good. And when you're basically not using your, your headset, you can just unplug it. And you would just bundle this up like this to a really small, small bundle. And then you just use a, uh, like a bread tie and just hold it in place. And you won't even know it's really there. Or you can get a really short one. You can cut the wires here and get a little short plug and just plug it right there so you don't have this extra wire, which I might do. But that's it. That's how you put some uh, speakers in your helmet. You don't have to worry about head headphones anymore. All right, thanks.